Why did John Wick choose AR-15? In Chapter 2, isn't it a sports rifle? Ah, good old John Wick, the master assassin that can wield a pencil with the same lethality as an assault rifle. So, why did he choose an AR-15 in Chapter 2? Well, folks, this is classic Hollywood. It's about what looks cool on screen, what's recognizable to the audience, and what adds to the characterization of the protagonist. First and foremost, while the AR-15 is indeed used by many as a sport shooting rifle, its design is based on the military M16. This gives it a certain appeal, a nod to its deadly efficiency and combat readiness, despite its civilian availability and use in recreational shooting. In John Wick Chapter 2, John doesn't just pick any AR-15, he opts for a tricked-out version. When you see Wick with that rifle, it's not about what the firearm was intended for, it's about the sheer adaptability and customizability of it. The AR-15 platform allows for numerous modifications, from barrel length to grip style, caliber changes, and much more. It's like a deadly Lego set for adults, and on screen, this versatility translates into Wick being prepared for any and every combat scenario. In the hands of John Wick, the AR-15 isn't a mere sports rifle. It's an extension of his will, a tool tuned to precision, much like his skill set. It's about precision, control, and the fact that it's semi-automatic, which in Wick's trained hands makes for controlled, clean shots instead of the spray-and-pray approach that a fully automatic firearm might suggest. Couple that with the fact that the AR-15 is an icon of American firearms culture, and you've got yourself something that resonates with the audience. It's cinematic shorthand for badass with a gun, and if there's anything that John Wick has taught us, it's that he's the epitome of badass, no matter what he's holding. Lastly, let's talk about the movie magic and practicality for the film creators. The AR-15's ubiquity makes it easy to procure for filming, and its popularity means there's a plethora of blank-firing replicas and airsoft versions which are ideal for safe, realistic on-screen action. So while the AR-15 may have roots as a sports rifle, in John Wick's universe, it's a symbol of lethality and adaptability, a testament to his unrelenting force. And in Portland, Oregon, where folks appreciate both the artistry of a finely crafted scene and the ethos of practicality, it makes perfect sense why John Wick would rock the AR-15 like it's going out of style. Because for him, in that rain of bullets, nothing else could fit the bill quite so perfectly.